found fossils. You sure did. Oh. We're in our happy place today. We are out at the Sheep River because it's fall and it's beautiful and we love it out here. Hey everyone, welcome to the Real McNeils. I hope that you are having a beautiful fall day because we have got mass amounts of fall around here, which doesn't happen very often. It lasted more than two weeks this year. There we go. I want to see this. Eighth wonder of the world. <laughs> well done. This was one determined beaver. It looks like it started chewing here and then came around and chewed it off right here. It's like it must be this tree here. That's a tree oh, this is fresh. Is it fresh? Yeah. We have discovered where the beaver live. All of this here will have tunnels up underneath of it that those beaver are living in. There's holes in the ground over here that we were just being careful of, but look at that. It's a brain rock. It looks like coral. <laughs> That's what Caden said. Caden found fossils. You sure did. Oh and you there too. How cool is that, Caden? I just busted open a rock and I found fossils. Oh, so there cool. No. Oh, look at that. Cool. What'd you find? Rockwood chips. It looks like petrified wood. So this is what the family does. When there's no real plan, they all end up out here looking for fossils. Strong stuff. Just destroying rocks for the heck of it. This is the rock that Caden found. I cannot tell if it's picking up all of the leaves in there or not, but there's actually texture. It's the coolest thing. It's not every day that you come out and find fossils. And no, it's not an animal, but the leaves will do. That's pretty cool. discovered that she had left her hoodie up here so I've walked all the way back and now it's just trying to figure out what sound hole she was playing in when she took it off and left it girls brought their American Girl dolls. They've been playing so much the last little while. And I had to laugh because just a second ago, both of them were up a tree. Yeah, I, um, Addison's doll, Belle, was holding on to my doll, Blair. How does she climb the tree? <laughs> oh, gentle with her face. Nice. Wait, I want to show mom. You set your girl down. No, I need 
Two girls in a tree. <laughs> what do you think of the time limit? Or like how long could they go? Four. It's like, do you want to ride with them? <laughs> We're on our way. I don't know if you can even see Kaden. There he is. We're on our way to get water so that we can put our fire out because we didn't think ahead as far as that goes. So somewhere over here, we can get down to the river. Maybe not right there. <laughs> Kaden and I have our water jugs and we are headed to find water. It's getting cold out. The stars have come out. It's been a beautiful day. I'm glad we came out. It felt like camping, but we don't get to crawl in the trailer. Now just to find a spot where we can actually get down to the river. Get some water. We're good. We made it home. I don't know if it was the fresh air or what, but it has got me so tired tonight. Got the girls in bed. Caden's hotted off to bed. And it was the funniest drive home. There were cows. There were a lot of range cows out in that area. And it was so funny because it was like a slalom of cows standing in the road in the pitch black. And I was going to try and capture it. And by the time that I realized I hadn't recorded any of it, it was too late. We were out of the cows. At one point there were black cows in the middle of the road. And let me tell you, when it is pitch black outside, you cannot see black cows in the middle of the road. And there was at one point, a mama cow and her baby standing there baby was eating and it just it was laughable honestly because it was us and then it was Clancy's dad behind us and then it was Keely and Mike behind that and so you can just see the lights going back and forth as we do the slalom through the cows Thanks so much for coming with us. We hope that you're enjoying these fall vlogs of all the gorgeous colors that we have going on around us. This isn't typical for us. We don't usually get this long of a fall. It's usually, it feels like two weeks. It's probably a bit longer than that, but oftentimes snow falls while the leaves are still on the trees and then it's just a hot mess, honestly, because it just rots underneath the snow and it's lovely. So we are getting super close to October and we don't have snow yet and we're super excited about that and we are having a gorgeous fall. We're starting to reach the end of it though. Weather's going to change soon. Thanks so much for watching. If you haven't hit that subscribe button and we'll see you soon.